Hello everyone. Um good day Sierra for months. So today um this is a new year. I really want to say a very big thank you to all of you that have been following us on this platform. May God bless you all. Uh, you know as you all know it's a new year and um the topic we want to talk about today is actually um have you have you particular you my viewer have you particularly done your own 2020 2024 planning your own 2024 farm planning and if you haven't done it i really want to tell you you should try and do it all right do it today or tomorrow today or tomorrow latest because that will be a guide if i mean a guide i'm talking about a guide where you'll be able to see the future looking at either a book or your phone or your tablet so you need to have a guide and that guide is what you have written down okay this thing i need to get this sort of thing okay let's take for this stand now as at last year you sold out over 500 bears 1000 bears and okay this year you have made a lot of money from selling those bars so you say oh this year i want to move higher for you to take that that critical decision you have to what make some farm planning and for you not to lose because if you want to go higher or you want to say okay this year i want to go for 1500 bears okay that 1500 bears the equipment you have in your farm will not be able to manage those 1500 bears i get me so you have to what understand that you need to have a farm planning and that farm planning means that you having a written thing even though it's not bound you even though it's not done by you it can be done by a, by an accountant your own particular accountant or your sales rep or your sales rep so what am i trying to say in essence is that what i'm trying to say is you need to have a farm plan a farm plan is so that you will know where you are lacking behind and where that you need to improve i particularly i have my own farm planning for this 2024 so you too as a farmer, you also need to have your own farm planning. Alright, so this topic is not really much like other topic, but I'm just trying to let you all understand that. Try as much as possible today or tomorrow. Try to have your own farm planning. If you are a poultry farmer, a pig farmer, a cultivator, um, you're into plantation, anyone you are, try to say, okay, this year we did well. You write it down. How much money do I make? You write it down. Okay, how do I? Okay, this mortality. What I have some mortality over fifty of them. What are like? What are the major cause? It might be Newcastle. It might be Gumbo. It might be call it name. In the terms of um, in terms of catfish farming, you can have um this thing. Stunt goods. You can ask yourself. Okay, what happened? Why are my fishes having stone goat? You can have um, this thing, um, black pearls, in terms of catfish. You can also have um, this thing. Uh, you know, so many, so many disease, so many jaundice, jaundice. You can have it in catfish where your catfish will be having some yellow, yellow parts in their body, like jaundice. So you can also have it in pig too. Um, cause the DOC is where the potassium power side is affecting the um, is affecting the pigs. So all those things you have to document them. That okay, last year, 50, 50 of my pigs died because of cause the DOCs. Um, okay, okay, another twenty died because of um, fever, pig fever. So you just have to keep down those records just to make sure that this year is different. So that is the reason why this farm plan is also important. And you will not have a good edge if you didn't document things last year. So this year, I want you to document everything. If possible, the one naira you put into that business. Even though it's the one naira that you put there, document it. Even though it's one cities that you put there, document it. Even though it's one dollar that you put there, document everything that you are spending on those animals just to make sure that you can make a good financial decision on how the next year which is 2025 will look like so please and please see your farmers i want you all to try and document everything 
and also give yourself a farm planning today or tomorrow i think that is all i have to tell you for this live video today and i also want to say a very big happy new year to everyone thank you and god bless you